what is up guys i'm back with another video guys hope you guys are having a wonderful day today i'll be showing you guys a brand new gsi ancient os i'm going to be honest this is probably the best gsi i've tested in a long long time it has customization like i've never seen before guys on an android 12 gsi it's amazing so let's just get into the video first i'm just going to show you the standardized apps it comes in so first of all it comes in with the phone app the contacts app the messaging app you can also flash google apps g apps on this also it comes with a browser already installed in it guys so this is the browser it has a dark theme so we have this so we also have the file manager right here so you can see this is the app draw this is the notification and all the settings so yeah as you can see there's multiple sections in this um, you can see that there are different settings you can add and there's super a lot customization features in this guys so let's just click the settings so this is the setting panel you're greeted with and guys even this can be customized in the GSI so let's just go with the standardized settings so it's the Samsung features we're gonna go first it's just which I show in every single video some customized features based on the phone you're using so yeah that's just some standardized features there's some MIS features customization features so this is the accent color you can change it and network Bluetooth um, location guys everything works perfectly so this is the connected device it's showing on your Bluetooth and this is some more ancient features this is the most customization just I was talking about but let's get back to that later and I'll show you show you guys everything else and then we'll get back so this is the display obviously you can change the resolution the display it has night light you guys might notice there's a longer video than before because guys this has so many this is, even has options for VR they have literally thought about every single scenario you have faced and it's amazing display you can switch from light to dark theme it does take a little bit while I thought it wasn't switching that's why I switched back I'm just gonna switch it back for you right there as you can see the white theme but let's roll with dark for the rest of the video as it's more friendly to the eyes so yep display size you can make it larger if you can't see that well up close to your phone but let's keep it to default as my eyes are perfectly okay guys so this display size as you can see that's all display customization so let's go security for this security features you have fingerprint face unlock pin and things so you can also change the wallpaper style and the type of wall wallpaper you have according to the style you guys like so I think that's amazing system or the di different system settings you can change the language reset options multiple users anything you guys want so let's get back to the customization guys this is the where the video really starts to kick in as you can see there's enormous amounts of customization add-ons it's just this is not customizing any of the GSI um, elements it's just adding more elements for you guys to customize that's how that's insane so I'm just showing you guys one by one now, of course I can go in depth review of this GSI obviously it's gonna be like a 30 minute video guys that's how much customization is in this GSI it is amazing so this is all the add-on features we have here um, there's multiple ones you guys can choose from I'll just demonstrate a couple here so you can so just small things like put the volume on the left on the right many different I'm just gonna show you guys right here so I'm gonna show you volume on the left because usually on the right side these small small customization features you can even customize the volume the you can even add a percentage which I've never seen in the GSI before and you can also customize the different styles that the volume racker has which is I've never seen such customization in a GSI it just blows my mind how much you can customize in this GSI obviously you can see there's different styles to choose from so um, basically who is this role GSI for for a guy who likes to go sorry um, who, who wants to customize their phone like a maniac guys if you want to customize every little thing this is the GSI for you and it's amazing 
also you can also add a ram to show you how much ram is available during your recent settings so let's move on to the status bar you can customize every little bit about the status bar how what icons clock and time settings you would like in the middle i prefer it in the middle i believe it looks incredible um as you can also show the seconds which i find pretty awesome you can also put a transparent clock on the left hand corner as you can see and tons and tons of individual customizations you can see you can always do clock background you can even change the background of the clock if you don't want it to match it that's awesome guys um battery settings you have different you can turn into a circle and you can customize every little bit of it obviously i'm not going to show you all of it it is incredible all right there's in themes um so basically you can change the setting themes which i'll show you guys later i actually changed it on the video and i didn't realize i changed it into later you obviously i'm gonna change it to a pikachu and you guys will see it um, obviously this is tons of tons of customization even as i'm scrolling through this guys with you guys right now um i'm like whoa do i even need to customize this but the thing the option is there which is incredible that's the important part um, you can also customize the roundness of the corners of the display. Do you like them round? Do you like them sharp? I mean, anything. It's amazing. More customization, Wi-Fi icon. Just tons. Look at how many fonts to choose from. It's the ultimate customization GSI for the A7 2018. And some more settings on top. I forgot to show you guys. So let me just show you. I'm just going to switch it to Pikachu just to show you guys that it actually changes so we just have to come out and um, so as you can see now the slider icon has turned into a Pikachu you can see on the slider so now it's a Pikachu themed GSI settings that's that's I mean it's not necessary it doesn't boost anything in performance but it's just a customization feature which can help your phone like look incredible any everything you can customize in your phone is this GSI it's amazing quick settings um, obviously you can see the Pikachu now the Pikachu logos and stuff on the quick let me show you the quick settings obviously you can customize every little bit one thing it does piss me off that sometimes they don't have all of them in other GSI's um, for example this clock you can add a clock if you like brightness slider you can change the type of slider you want look as you can see now we're gonna have a different one a pink one with like um, translucent colors so that's good feature to have. Um, what else do we have, guys? Here, um, we have vibrate on touch. So now, when you touch a quick send, you get a vibration, which makes your phone feel more premium. As on other GSIs, doesn't work like that. But on this one, you can even customize the amount of vibration you want per click when you click it. So also the button settings, like which what buttons you want to do. Obviously, seven thousand eighteen doesn't have a lot of buttons to choose from. Um, power menu obviously if you want to be like a meaning like me you can just click everything if you want all the options in the whole world just click everything guys <laughs> as you can see you're stacked <laughs> anything you would ever want in a power menu right there <laughs> obviously not necessary but good to have just this guy so it also has some cool just the settings that you can customize to your liking um, right now you know we can we're rocking the old Android um, square circle triangle thing so let's we're gonna change it later I'm just gonna show you guys all this you can also advance gestures um, you can also draw on your screen to open apps it has everything guys so Aesop so this is the standard one so I'm just gonna switch to the gesture one just right here just in a second yep just gonna click gesture navigation and we have shifted over to the gesture navigation standard of android 12. so yep this is just the settings system navigation guys all the different customization going to be adjusted anything you guys want so that's it for the gestures guys um just gonna go to scroll down a little bit um lock screen you can customize the lock screen um how long it stays um the different two apps on the bottom it's amazing you can even put a temperature how much how hot is your phone on there which is just incredible I think um, we also have the navigation bar which you can customize which we already did no need to customize that um, n notifications um, how big you want the notifications um, do you want 
um jumpy notification i don't know what's called animations guys you can also change the closing animation which i'll show at the end of the video um it's really amazing the battery like if you really want you can turn off the pixels which is not used and it will here we go smart pixels you might not notice anything but on my screen it just turns off the pixels which are not in use which will prolong battery life in nestle guys it's amazing honestly Minilasis, so all the different other things that are not thing you can even it is for gaming features actually so you can actually force high fps your phone will get harder guys but it will make games less laggy and more playable which i find amazing usb you can check what plug in a usb i like to always keep it on file transfer just in case anything happens you know when we're while we're wanting the gsi and then we're just gonna go there and that's it for the video pretty much guys um i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i really think this is a awesome gsi um make sure to like subscribe share and hope you guys have a wonderful day goodbye guys just joking that's the closing animation which i find awesome see you guys next time